So this question is related to the cluster in Oracle Fusion Middleware High Availability that could be applicable to either standalone WebLogic server or SOA OBI Web Center Identity and Access Management component like OAM, OIM, OID or anything except OHS. So the question is, can cluster be configured in WebLogic or SOA later? Which means you've created a WebLogic domain and configured the components in single node without any cluster. Can this be done later? And answer is yes, absolutely. So depending on which Fusion Middleware product you're doing, if it's a standalone WebLogic server, you go to console and create the WebLogic managed server and cluster and add these two or more managed servers in a cluster. If it's a component like OBI EE, there is some additional steps on that because you're going to add some system components and also some additional configuration. Similarly, but if it's component like SOA, you go and create additional managed servers and target the applications which are targeted on the first SOA server, you target it to the second SOA server as well, and you can extend the SOA or any other Fusion Middleware product into a cluster at a later stage as well. Thank you.